Hi and welcome to altering the melodic minor or expanding the melodic minor to get some different scales and sounds for improvising. What I'm going to do is to review the melodic minor scale. I like to view the scale like in a... with a voicing like this, a Bill Evans type of chord, melodic minor too. Chord. This chord here, it's like a, a vertical summary of the melodic minor scale because it has the, the tonic, the fifth, the major seventh, the minor third, the thirteen and the nine, six and nine. So if I, if I insert the, the four, the fourth here, I have the whole scale, like... So, it's like a, a summary, a vertical summary of the scale, right? So, I, 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 I like to start from here. The melodic minor. The C, the C melodic minor, I'm gonna... I'm gonna see it around this, this shape. Of course, around this... There are many shapes, right? But we're gonna start with this one. Because here we can see that this is a, a minor 6 chord. C minor 6, but if I consider this chord an F9 chord, it will be 5th, 3rd, flat 7 and 9, right? So it, it, it could be in this, in this realm here of F, F7. And of course, if I have a I have this relationship here, F7, B altered. As a B altered, this would be the flat 9, the flat 7, 3rd, and flat 13 or sharp 9, or sharp 5, sharp 5, I'm sorry, right? So, So this is a very good way to learn the modes of the melodic minor because you learn everything f from one shape and depending on where you start on the scale you are playing in a different scale like this one that is the altered scale. In this lesson we are dealing only with the dominant modes of the melodic minor scale situations in a tune like for, for instance like this chord here that it's actually uh, a a7 the, the seven note scale for this chord would be the Mixolydian flat 9 scale, right? So... So this is a very important scale, right? So we have...